Thou Shalt Not came about. My husband gave me the novel to read, and I read it and was intrigued by it and thought it would make a wonderful theater piece. I called my collaborator, David Thompson, and we started to think about how we could adapt this for the theater. And um, it, is, takes, it, it takes place in Paris, but we thought what might be wonderful is to set it in New Orleans and have that same sort of uh, flavor. If I can love you when you're older, let me, let me, let me, let me love you. I had been an admirer of Harry Connick's and loved his music and I thought, what harm could it be? I'll call him and say, how about doing a Broadway show? How about doing a show at Lincoln Center? And see what he says, all he can say is no. And in fact, he was intrigued and we started to work together and, and Harry loved the process and loved the process of putting on a Broadway show and creating a Broadway school. <laughs> Are we just going to have a good time, ain't that right, Laurent? A good time! There's a character in Thou Shalt Not called Camille, and uh, there was a fellow that came into audition named Norbert Leo Butts, and he was wonderful at the audition. He had the very flavor of New Orleans, uh, and uh, he really understood that character. And the thing about Norbert too, he's, he's not a dancer, but he moves so well. And he was able to make that character move with sensuality, but also with an aggressiveness that made him a real showman. I think for all artists who work at Lincoln Center Theater, there is, there's something about um, the process you feel so protected, you feel so supported uh, from the entire building, from not only from uh, Bernie and Andre, but, but just from everyone that works here. Everyone is there for, the, for you and for the show and for the artists. That, in fact, anyone who works here um, has a strong camaraderie with one another. We still have parties with the contact cast every year. We all get together, and I think that, sh that is still the same with most companies that happen. You become very close to one another. In the theater there is a, a, a desperate passion to make a show work and uh, at Lincoln Center it is a desperate passion for everyone.